growing fear among business owners caught up in Philadelphia's gun violence epidemic. Employees are increasingly becoming the targets of criminals, leading some owners to bring in professional help. Action News reporter George Solis live now at police headquarters with the details on this sad story, George. That's right, Brian and Sarah. We spoke with several armed security guards throughout the city of Philadelphia today who told us their services are at a premium. They say with the rampant gun violence, including the murder of that Duncan manager in North Philadelphia over the weekend, some businesses now have no choice but to hire them. Video of the brazen and cold-blooded murder of this Duncan employee in North Philadelphia over the weekend has sparked anguish and outrage. She complied with you. She gave you what you wanted, and yet you still decided to take that young lady's life. Why? Wow. Police said even after giving in to the suspect's demand for cash, this mother, daughter, and grandmother was shot anyway. It's senseless. It don't make no sense. The things that are going on out here, is, it's crazy. For this man who asked we not share his name, it's a tragedy he feels he may have been able to prevent. Why? For more than a decade, he's worked in security, most recently armed. You feel that you are the deterrent? Yes. Yes. Um, I've, I've dealt with a lot in this field. I've seen a lot in this field, so. He's not alone. A lot of these stores need to step the game up and start higher armed security because Philadelphia, it seemed like it used to be brotherly love, but it's not brotherly love no more. Armed security specialist Howard Sanchez wants to be the one to protect the Duncan when and if it reopens. It's not about a paycheck for him. His son, who knew Lugo, also works here. When he called me, he was crying. Like, he couldn't stop crying. He was like, why her? Why her? Monday, Mayor Jim Kenney also addressed the killing and violence that continues plaguing the city. There's two quick access to guns in this country and in this state. Kenny declared strategies in addressing the gun violence epidemic are changing in the post-pandemic era. But some security experts believe for the time being, they may be the best solution. Had this Dunkin' Donuts had armed security at that hour when this robbery occurred, it would have been prevented. Now, some community members out there today were passing out these Who Killed Christine flyers with 215-688 tips save our city to help try and find her killer. And, of course, anyone with information is also asked to contact Philadelphia Police. Reporting outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters, George Solis, Channel 6 Action News. Brian. Okay, George, thank you.